Mama's boy. Longer <laughs> Vic's gone too far. At this rate, he'll chop the whole forest down. We can't let him. But Bramble, we can't keep chasing him. We need to stop him for good. Oh. <sighs> Help me! 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 Somebody help me! Bramble, we gotta go save him! Please help me! What's wrong with Logger Vic? I got it! He just needs a little of the old CPR! Hang on, Logger Vic! You can count on Bramble! Hook her up, big guy! Gotcha! I got it! Mama. Take care of yourself when you're away from home. Mama, don't leave me. Please don't leave me. I miss you. Bro, so what's the matter with him? Huh? His cheeks look just like tomatoes. Let me check. Oh, he's running so hot. I think he has a fever. A fever? Mama. Oh. I'm sorry, I don't know. He's running a high fever. We have to help him. Find some medicine or something. Let's split up and look. Huh? Huh? Lager Vic, where are you going? Hey, where's he going, bro? He's so sick, he must be hallucinating. Go, let's check it out. Oh. Water. Kettle. Uh, uh, uh. 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 Oh, he looks really sick. I'm worried about him. There's nothing even in this kettle. If we weren't here with him, the house would have burned down. While he's sick, we better keep an eye on him and keep him safe. We don't want him to get any worse. Yeah. Boil some water in this kettle. I'll watch Vic. Mm -hmm. I'll get you a cup of water. Oh. Huh? Bro, wake up. I'm up. Logger Vic. Huh? Oh, no, no, no. Uh, Ouch, that's hot! Vic, look out! <gasps> Hi, that smarts! Huh? You okay? <laughs> Briar, it hurts real bad. I'll never be able to wear shoes again. Calm down. You don't wear shoes. We have to find Vic. <laughs> Boys and girls, when you're at home alone, please remember, stay away from boiling water. It's Bramble, hot. get over here. Coming. Uh, huh? Totally get over here and get him off me. Vicky, sweetie, you are my pride and joy. I'll go now. Have a good rest, my darling. Uh, uh, please don't go. Hold it. Oh, oh, no, no. No, I'm so cold. Bro, he looks cold like that. Hmm. Let's cover him with the quilt. No. Huh? Uh, please don't. Please don't go. I'm so cold. Uh, Vic, uh, I am not your mama. Briar, just give him a hug, bro. Just look at how happy he is. Uh, Bramble? Huh? Go find some more porridge for him. He 
He needs his strength. <laughs> Come on, uh, open up. Ah. Uh, uh, oh, what the apple? Okay, I don't want porridge. I want apple. Sweet, juicy apple. I want apple. Sweet, juicy. What? Bro, should you? <laughs> Just a second. Here, apple. Oh, it's not peel. Peel it or I won't eat it. Huh? <gasps> Hmm? I'll go peel it. Uh, hold on, Logger Dick. Just a second. He's, he's just gonna peel it. Ha! Ah, all done. Here you go. Peeled apple for you. Here you go. Ah, it's too big. It's too big. I want to cut it to pieces. What? <laughs> 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 really hard, Logger Dick, Mom. Hold your horses! What a crybaby. Apple slices, Vic. That's still too big! I want smaller ones! I can't eat these with my baby mouth! Mama! Mama, they're too big for my Will you stop being such a spoiled mouth. brat? I am not your mother! Try it! Keep your shirt on! He's just a baby! <sighs> your apples. Just right. <laughs> oh, there's a good boy. <sighs> Please cut them even smaller. What? Logger Vic, are you kidding me? Uh, calm down, bro. He's really sick. Do you like the apples? Mama cuts the apples just right there. <laughs> oh, sweetie, honey, you are my good boy. Logger Vic must be dreaming of his mama. He's smiling so sweet. <laughs> Uh-oh. Hey. <laughs> That's not how my mama smells. No. Huh? No. No. Briar, no. what should we do now, bro? Uh, All right, fine. Uh, just hand him here. Uh, mama. Well, you're not my mama. My huh? mama smells uh, like lovely rice. Like rice? I love my mama. How do I smell uh, like mama. rice? Uh, Got it. Uh, uh, uh. There, there, Logger Vic. Your mom will be right back. Just take a nap. That's a good boy. Ah. Huh? Huh? Hey! <laughs> Bro, what you doing? You got me all wet. <laughs> Bro, why are you smelling me? <laughs> you smell like rice. Just like rice. Come on. Right <laughs> here. Don't ask me why. Just wait and see what Vic does. does work. That's not enough. If he eats rice porridge full of mother's love, he will recover soon. Wow. This looks great. Ooh, hot, 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 hot. <laughs> Logger Dick, wake up. Have some porridge here. Now, that is my oh, mom's wait porridge. Wait a minute, it's hot. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Oh, yummy. Oh, Sunny, open your mouth! Gee, mm. it sure is the flavor of her. Oh, sweeter than anyone else. She's the best. No one can compare to my mom. Uh. <laughs> so have some more! <laughs> Uh, oh, open it. Mm, that's good. Huh? Oh, brother. Here we go again. Thanks, Ma. Mm. You're the best, Ma. Mm. It's not easy being Logger Vic's mom. Hey, the fever is gone. <sighs> now let's go home and get some sleep. Let's go. <laughs> Briar, if Logger Vic is completely recovered and goes logging tomorrow, what should we do? We have no choice. We'll have to stop him. But today... Today he was our patient. So you're not angry? We always take care of our patients. Uh, uh, such a great night's sleep. Dreaming about my mama. The best thing ever. That's it! I think today I'll call mommy. 
<laughs> Vic's cabin. <laughs> Breaking news, geologists have announced that surrounding areas may experience sudden earthquakes. City officials are requesting that citizens follow protocol and stay away from houses marked dilapidated. This is for your own safety. Boring. <laughs> earthquakes don't scare me. <laughs> this here place is the safest around. Huh? What? They condemned it? Darn. Huh? Huh? What's this? From the council. Mr. Von Finkelstein, blah, blah. Dilapidated, torn down. Torn down? Why, you? Come on! Ridiculous! Ha! Hello! How dare you do this to me? What on earth is wrong with this place anyway? Well, for starters, all the logs are rotten. I'm afraid, Mr. Vic, we're going to need you to move out <laughs> right away. There will be an inconvenience payment and we'll provide housing. Thank you for understanding. This is for oh, your safety. Uh, Radio. Ooh, wow. I guess there's no other way. I've been here for so long I can't imagine living anywhere else. Briar! That's unfair! <laughs> it's my honey! But you gave it to me. It's a gift! <laughs> Briar! Shh! Huh? Mm. Why has he got all his tools? He must want to cut down the whole forest. What? We gotta huh? stop him, bro! Mm -hmm. Right. Logger Vic? Uh -huh. Well, hi there! What are you up to? It's so good to see ya! I was gonna stop by. What do you say? You visit us? You were gonna cut down cut trees! Cut down? Hmm. Ah, huh? Just chill out, guys. <laughs> Don't lie to us. We see your saw. Uh, hey, hold on there. Take a chill pill, you two. So you see, guys, I ain't chopping. Oh, I'm moving. Huh? <laughs> Did you hear that, bro? He says he's moving. It's the council, not me. It's old. And I, I've got to move to town while I rebuild it. Oh? Hey, do you think I could have this cool fan? It's a gift for you from me. All right, a new fan. <laughs> Oh, but Vic, I don't want you to have to leave. Hmm. You know, every year we fix anything wrong on your house. And that's why it's still standing today. If you want, we can repair your cabin for you, so it's safe to live in. You're right. How come I didn't think of that? If we fix it up nice enough, it won't be dangerous. And then I won't have to move out at all. We'd love to help you with the repairs. Hmm. <laughs> okay, go! <clears throat> <laughs> All done. Next one. Yeah. Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> hey, Vic. <laughs> <laughs> All done? <laughs> Give him a call. This is Logger Vic. I've repaired my cabin. Can you send an officer to check it, please? Uh -huh. <sighs> hey, Vic, hey, what'd they say? What's the Come on, what tell us. They, they said it's no good, and we haven't done enough. The cabin is worn out. It's, uh, over. I'll be moving out of here. Oh. Not enough? It's just because your cabin's a little dirty. What if we cleaned it up? Let's see here now. I reckon I cleaned about a year ago. What? <laughs> oh, brother. All right, what do you say we get this party started? I'll start looking for some paint. Right behind you. Lego. Hey, uh, booty bears to the rescue. <laughs> What did he say? What did he say? What did he say? Do you get to stay? That officer said no matter what we do to it, the cabin's rotting from the inside. They still have to tear it down. <sighs> so I guess I'm moving after all. What? That's huh? not even fair. I'll go have a talk with them. Easy, Bramble. We're bears. They won't listen to us. 
Logger Vic, we've tried everything. Yeah. Oof. Well, bears, goodbye. Logger Vic, this fan will remind me of you. I'll cherish it. I'm gonna miss you guys. Well, goodbye, Vic. Bye. So long. <sighs> Good night, my cabin. Sleep tight. <laughs> Goodbye, my abode. Attention, citizens. There will be a magnitude 4 earthquake. Please follow our instructions to the evacuation area. Ah! Ah! Oh my goodness, it's the earthquake! Ah! 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 Well, I'll be. That was a close one, I'll tell you. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness, this is terrible! <laughs> Hey, hey, it's all over with. Oh, I better go and check my cabin. What's wrong with this door? I'm trapped. Help me! Help! Help huh? me! That sounds I'm like... Trapped. Mother Vic! Help! Ah, Mother Vic! Vic. The Here you are Oh, yeah! yeah. <laughs> We're here to save you! It's the rocks Hang blocking there, my buddy. door. Don't panic. We'll get you out of there. Uh, oh, uh, Logger Vic, we are glad uh, you're safe, buddy. I think the earthquake is over now. Uh, my cabin! Huh? huh? Logger Vic! Uh, thank goodness, it's just like I left it. <laughs> Logger Vic, you were worried about your yeah. house? Of course it's fine, yeah? it's too strong. <laughs> <laughs> well, it sure looks like our repairs proved that right. officer wrong. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Oh, no! No! Oh, easy, Vic! Thank you, Take thank you easy. so much! Huh? Huh? <laughs> the housing officer! No way! <laughs> the earthquake is all over! Uh, There's nothing I can do anymore. It's done. <sighs> so Logger Vic still has to move, Briar? Let's get out of here, bro. Oh. Think, Vic. <laughs> Mr. Vic! Are you home? Huh? Did he move out already? <laughs> Uh, don't move a muscle! Uh, it survived the earthquake! It doesn't deserve to be knocked down, it's strong! <laughs> don't worry, I'm not going to hurt your house. Then what are you doing here? <laughs> Let's settle down first. That's great! So you don't have to move then! Mm -hmm. Since I was putting up such a fuss about it, they had it looked at by the Historical Society. And it turns out, this place is a national treasure. Wow, amazing! It's true! Hard to believe, right? But hey, that's what the expert said. In fact, it's a thousand years old. And he said it should stand for another thousand years. <laughs> wow. Huh, that incredible. sounds awesome. And he also said that it might be the last one of its kind anywhere. Ancient history alive today. Sounds uh, awesome. Uh, <laughs> oh, I bet there'll be lots of tourists coming to visit. I'm gonna be rich. <laughs> Ooh, we want to be your first customers. <laughs> <Stop>! <laughs> huh? Don't shake it so hard, huh? it's expensive. Uh, <gasps> well, you stop uh, it! Huh? What do you think you're doing? That's a cultural artifact! <laughs> it's a cabin! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Vic here. Hi, hello, it's the housing office. Ooh, got more good news for me, do ya? You? You're turning into my best friend. You're kidding me! Oh, you mean my cabin isn't of historical significance? Uh, but why? Sorry, it seems the historical expert thought he was on a different mountain. Oh, it turns out it's just a regular uh, log cabin. Are you there? Oh well, I'm still gonna be able to live here. Uh, I think something's missing. 
My fan! <laughs> hey, stop! I want my fan! <laughs> it was a gift! Uninvited wasps. Hmm. I wonder where that honey is. Oh. Ah! There it is! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Uh oh. Ah! Oh! Huh? Ah! Huh? Oh. Why is it empty? Hmm. Last time, it was more like. Ah! Don't sting me! Where did all those little honeybees go to? Hmm. That's odd. The honeycomb is empty. I'm going on a walk with my Babu? best friend. Huh? The fruit? Huh? Mm, yum. Ah, uh, mm. What's that bee doing? Mm. Uh, this is the king's apple. How dare it, you? Shoo now. Go away. Shoo. Oh, so annoying. You had better get away. Shoo now. Shoo. Sir, get down. <laughs> the king's nose. <laughs> I'm all set. Time to get logging. <laughs> I feel fully charged today. It's gonna be a great day. Huh? <laughs> how could have that huge beast nest ended up on my front porch? Now how the heck am I gonna get to work today? Wait a sec. I bet those bears put it there to keep me from logging. They sure are crafty sometimes. Huh? Yeah? What? Oh, Victor! <gasps> what are you still doing at home? Get out there and get to work! Uh, you gotta understand, boss. There's a huge bee's nest on my front porch. So? So, I can't get out of the house. Oh, I see. Well, you just stay at home and relax. That's insanely incredible. That's never happened before. Hey, thanks very much, Mr. Lee. Oh, don't mention it. You can stay at home forever. I'll just hire someone else to replace you. <laughs> Good idea. Wait, what? You don't have to do that. You know, I was just horsing around. Bees won't stop me. Then what are you waiting uh... for? Briar, I searched the whole entire forest, but I couldn't even find a single drop of honey. More like you ate all the honey yourself with no thought of your poor brother. What? I did no such thing. How come you never believe me, Briar, huh? I'm your brother. You know, I don't think I even saw a single bee either. Didn't see a single bee? Hmm, I know. Uh, maybe all the honeybees, they went on strike. On strike? Bramble, you're the only one who's gone on strike. Uh, I'm not lying, I mean it! Brian, uh -huh. We got a big problem! What's going on? What's the problem? They got him, they got him, it's bad. Come on, spit it out! Tiki was attacked! <laughs> <laughs> Seems to me, couldn't be a bee sting. But that's what it is. I didn't see any bees earlier when I was looking around the forest for honey. Huh? Tiki, tell me where you saw the bees at. Maybe it can lead me to the honey. <laughs> you ain't huh? my shit. Ah! Wouldn't you be more concerned with your me. king's help? Ah, calm down, calm down, take it easy. Tiki, just relax. It's not Bramble's fault. Warren's on his way with some herbal medicine. I won't be forgetting this. It is an act of war. Oh, oh my beautiful royal nose. Briar! Briar! Here's that herbal medicine. All right, remember to keep it on your nose. Should heal in a few days. By the way, Tiki, are you sure it was a bee that stung you? Oh, yes, but they were a little larger. Larger, you say? And much longer, too. Very interesting. Hmm. Ah. Uh, uh. It must be a wasp. A, a wasp? wasp? While the bee and the wasp are similar, they are two very different insects. First of all, the wasp is much slimmer than a bee. The bee looks huh? like bramble, round. Oh. While the wasp is much thinner, like Warren. Uh. <laughs> now, now, the bee is a phytophagous insect. He feeds on pollen. In other words, it's a vegetarian and tiny. By contrast, the wasp is much bigger in size. In addition to gathering nectar from flowers, the adult wasp is also a meat eater. Caterpillars, for example, are its number one source of prey. The wasp only eats injured insects, making it a kind of scavenger. 
so that's why I didn't see any bees in the honeycomb earlier. The wasp is a much grumpier insect than the bee. <laughs> Lots of people every year get stung by wasps, so be careful. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see now. Now that is a fierce insect, all right. Luckily, I wasn't injured. I could have died. Ah! Uh, hello? You're slacking off again? How many trees you cut down? Oh, it's you, Boss Lee. What do I say? I guess I'll just lie. I've got about 20, and I'm real busy, as you know. I'll call you later. Bye, Boss Lee. <sighs> I gotta find a way out of here. Otherwise, I won't finish this month's quota. Briar, what are we gonna do? There isn't any honey anywhere! <sighs> First, we need to figure out where the wasp's home nest is, before we do anything. But bro, how are we supposed to find out where their nest is? Huh? Oh! Bro, oh, I know where it is! Where? Where is it? I saw it over on Lagervik's front porch. He must plan on driving us away, so he kept those wasps. But what thing about the Victor? He will also be getting sting. Very true, Sam. Yo, that's true. There? I don't think wasps keep their stingers. Hmm. To be sure, we better check it out. Ow! Ah. <laughs> the bees won't notice me. Help me! Oh, get away from me! Victor is using that bee to try and dethrone me. This is being an act of war! Help me! <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Help me! <laughs> get out of here! Help me! Hey! Hey, come back here! Oh, get away from me! Almost. Ah! Ryan, that hurts! I'm being as gentle as I can! Mm, Logger Vic, it's your fault! This is what happens when you keep wasps! Huh? What do you mean? You've been keeping wasps? You huh? put that nest on my front porch in order to trap me! That's Ooh. not true! You took uh. that back! <laughs> How can you blame others for your own mistakes, huh? Uh, I've never done that before! Alright, that's enough of that! Right now, we need to figure out where the wasp nest is. Hmm... I have a plan! First, we split up. <laughs> Lagervik? We're counting on you. Huh? Why does it have to be me? I'm just as much a victim as you guys. But you're the only person who can do this. The wasps only seem to chase you. Huh? No. -o. I am not willing to get stung again. Huh? All oh, right. No, wait. Let's Please head home. Please don't go. Please. I know it has to be me. Yeah, that's the spirit. <laughs> Here. Hide inside this. There. Good. The leaves on top will protect you. Off you go. You can do it. Hi, little ones! You remember me? Hmm? <laughs> Come, now's our chance! Good, Jerry, hurry! They'll be back soon! <laughs> Get up, we gotta hide! <laughs> Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! What have I got myself into? Here! Hmm? Yeah! Logger <laughs> 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 Vic, you can come out now! No more wasps! Hmm? Hey! Briar, what should we do with that, huh? Uh... Okay, just leave it with me. <laughs> hey, bro, does this mean that we get to eat honey again? Hmm, I wonder where those bees were hiding. With the wasps gone, maybe the honey will come back. Oh, Briar, I am getting a little bit worried, you know. Logger Vic is bad. Relax, Tiki, I think Logger Vic learned his lesson. Well, hello there, boss. Did you receive the package I sent you? I received ah, something worthless! Ah. 
Where is my lumber? Boss, listen. That's an expensive healthcare product. It's straight out of the forest. <laughs> is this some sort of a prank? I got huh? stung! Forget about getting paid! <sighs> Summer forest party. Tiki, why in the world did you call us together? <sighs> so early. Well, because I decided to have a summer forest party for everyone. <laughs> Another party, but don't you think the last one was, well, to put it bluntly, a total bore fest? What makes you think this one will be any different? <coughs> that is so the past. This one is going to be the best wow. party that you ever... Would you look at those pretty blossoms? Oh, Aren't you listening to what your king is saying? Huh? 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 Wow, look at these beauties. Babu, uh, you will be taking whoa. note of this. Huh. This summer's forest party will be the best youth party in history. And then I'll be the greatest king in the whole widing world. Sire, yes, sire. <laughs> Please stop calling me sire. I am the greatest king. Sounds good, sire. I said, calling me greatest king. Hey, Tiki, with all these blossoming flowers, it's the perfect time to host a summer party. I know you'd come around. Hello? Who's that? It's me! Oh, hi, Boss Lee. How are you? A ya? big client of mine has ordered a 100-year-old Sephora Japonica tree. I need one of those before the end of the day. You get me that tree or else. Huh. You can forget about the rest of your quarter for today. But if you don't get me that tree, you're fired! But boss, hey, what? Oh. A 100-year-old Sephora Japonica tree. Where in the forest? I remember seeing it somewhere. I just can't remember where it was exactly. What a boring challenge. Hmm, huh? Hold on, I saw one of them the other week, I'm sure. <laughs> it's gotta be here somewhere. Who's that laughing? Bramble, huh? quit messing around. Just carry them. Sorry, bro. What are they up to? It's curious. Maybe it's a shindig. Perfect. Last time they had a party in the spring, and I was cutting down loads of trees. <laughs> Let's see. A Sephora petal? Ooh. I knew you were around here somewhere. Now you guys have fun. Meanwhile, I'll get on with chopping that 100-year-old beauty down. Everybody coming here and drinking juice? <laughs> oh, it's <laughs> not <laughs> oh, so Don't be grabbing. <laughs> oh? Oh. Huh? Pew! Pew! Now what do you want? 
There won't be any logging, okay? That's, That's right! right. Oh, it's not like that. I'm not cutting trees. You just presume the worst. That's not neighborly of you. So why are you here then? Uh, I thought you might invite me to your party. I was really hoping. Hoping uh, that we'd fall for your tricks. That's here, here. Here. Last spring, we invited you to come to our flower smelling party, but the whole time you just tried to catch us. Come on, guys. That's behind me now. I'm sorry. Anyway, you know what they say. Keep your enemies closer. If Lager Vicky huh? wanted you attending our party, then as the greatest king of the forest and the whole big wedding of world, I say, why not? Oh, really? Thank <laughs> <laughs> you, Majesty. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Here, have more. <laughs> 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 yeah, Bramble, awesome, bro. Oh, this tree is a beast. I need to think of a way to lure those animals away before I begin. But how exactly? Come on, Vic. Think. Think. <laughs> you go, bro. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? Hey, look. Look at Vic. What? Why do you think he's sitting there, bro? I have no idea. Let's go ask him, yeah? Sure. Huh? What's on your mind, Logger Vic? Well, uh, uh been a alone time. <laughs> uh, are you feeling a bit lonely? Is that it, uh -huh. Vic? <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, don't cry. <laughs> All you gotta do is give up logging. Huh? <sighs> then we can be friends. Logger's oh. not really me. It actually huh? makes me feel bad. But I need to survive. <gasps> we humans have to work. But do you know what's frustrating me? I've been living in this forest for years, but I have not one friend. <sighs> Woe is me. I really envy you. <sighs> well, if you weren't a logger, I think we would have been best friends all along. The choice is yours, Vic. Exactly. Logging aside, you're actually pretty cool, Vic. What? Huh? Do you mean it? Yeah. Do you guys really think of me as your friend? <laughs> <laughs> of course. Quit that logging. You can become our bestest friend. Yeah, you heard him. We'll be friends forever. Oh, it's going to be so great. Oh, I, Logger Vic, declare that I'm a, not going to be a lumberjack ever again. Hey, Logger Vic, you want to play this slingshot game with me? Ah! <laughs> I'll go first. Oh my goodness, that slingshot is... Ah! Please, ah! let me go first, please. <laughs> okay then, you first. Hiya, <laughs> allow me. Uh, <laughs> I'm really scared. <laughs> <laughs> such a guy, <laughs> baby. <laughs> Oh, come on, come on. Let's play this game now. Yeah. Hey, Vic, which mask do you want? Yeah, I choose this one. Don't you think it's cute, huh? Yes, they're being so nice to me. I need to stop them from putting on that mask. Right. Uh, hey. what? This one won't suit you. I'll get another one. Oh, Vic, watch out! Uh, huh. Uh, it's stuck. Uh, 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 That's weird. How did the mask get stuck uh, to his butt? Rebel! Ooh. Don't just stand there. Help me get this thing off. Oh, oh. Uh, One, two, uh, three. Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> oh. Hi, thank you. I know! I called you! Did you find the tree? Well, uh... <laughs> Hello? Well, did you get the tree? Sorry, um, not quite yet. Excuse me? Not quite yet? What have you been doing? I won't be paying you a single penny for any of the work you've done this month! Hello? Hello, <sighs> Huh? 
Look at this. We saved the last juice just for you. <laughs> Friends over money. That's what I say. Well, my new philosophy anyway. Save some of that juice. <laughs> 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 Angry Bird I think I lost him. <laughs> Baby, what a fine tree, and I'm all alone with no bears in sight. Mm -hmm. Ah, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, birdie. Oh, hey! Oh, wise guy. Go away, bird. Can't you see I'm busy here? You did to my pants. Huh? Oh. Get out! Oh. That's enough. You're going to leave me alone. Pesky bird. Now, where was I? I guess today's not my day. Oh. <laughs> it's been nice seeing you. I gotta go, though. Bye. <laughs> uh, uh, I won't allow you to keep destroying the forest. <laughs> I better not see you out here again. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Another one down. Oh, man, I was too late. Huh? What's this? It looks like Lagervik's hat. Oh, and an egg. Wait a second. I gotta go find the mama bird and fast. Pal, I just can't help you with this. I'm not ready to be a mother. But hoo hoo, I can't find its real mother. You know you can do it. Just give it a try. Uh, uh, um, but the thing is, I don't really know how to hatch eggs, Bramble. Huh? That's easy. You just hug the egg real close like it was your best friend. Huh? Sorry, Bramble, but I can't be seen sitting on an egg. Uh, see you later. Oh man, what am I going to do now? You poor little thing. I need to think of a way to persuade Hoo Hoo. La 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 la. Hoo Hoo, wait! Huh? <laughs> Rambo! Ah! <laughs> Hoo Hoo, please Rambo, help me! Rambo, seriously, stop Hoo -hoo. following me, okay? Uh, Bramble, go away! Leave me alone! Uh, uh, I'm exhausted. Huh? Huh? Oh? 
Wow! Oh, look at him! He's so cute and little and tiny! <laughs> What? You want to be its dad? <laughs> but... But you can't. Oh, but bro, look at it. Ain't he cute? Uh, See? Look. Huh? Come on. I couldn't find the mama bird anywhere, bro. <sighs> All right. This will be his home. How can I say no to that face? Hello. <laughs> He's staying. Yeah. Braver, it must be hungry. Yeah. Why don't you go out and find some food? Okay! <laughs> Let's go! I see no bears. All righty. Let's go. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Too slow. <laughs> it's time for your din din. Come on. Open up. <laughs> What's that? That's Logger Dick's chainsaw. Oh. <laughs> It's you. Come back for more of the same, have you? No, <laughs> oh, leave me alone, you stupid bird. Go away. Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you can't get through my safety helmet. Too bad, bird. Ah! My hard hat. Give it back to me. Huh? <laughs> oh, somebody help me! Huh? <laughs> what did he do this time? Let's go. Come on. Oh, save me! <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's that taken care of. You can't outwit Logger Vic. Uh huh. It's a bit quiet. Huh? It could have flown away. Huh. Hold on here. Oh! Oh no! Oh, the window! Ah! Ah! I have a weapon, and I'm not afraid of you, Dad. Uh oh! Come on, you! Go and dispatch that bird. Oh, I'm safe now. Baby, get off of me! What's going on? You having a party? Order, Vic! Oh, get off of me! Get off of me! <laughs> Logger Vic, you know what you did? You went and chopped down these birds' home tree, and that's why you were attacked. Oh, I didn't know that. Vic, huh? you too, Fabian. You owe them both an apology. Oh, I'm sorry. Really, I am. I'll take you back home. I think you'll like it. You know what? I built it super special for you. Mm. The 
mama bird and the baby bird together again. <laughs> it's so sweet! <laughs> huh? no. mm. Um, hey, Drake, do you want some honey? Uh, okay. <laughs> Follow me! <laughs> Roger Vic, you gotta stop chopping down animals' homes. Oh, I will. I promise. Roger Vic's lottery. Number 15. 15, come on! The first winning number is... 15. 15. 15! Oh, 15! Yeah! I got one. Okay, next. And now we have the second number. 24. 24! Come on, 24! It's coming out. It's 24! Oh, wow, I got the first two numbers. There's only one left to go. If I get all the numbers, I'll get a big jackpot. <laughs> 18. 18. Come on, Eddie! And here comes the last one. Make it so. Isn't this exciting? What will it be? And the last number is... 18! Uh, but For those who missed it, here again, 18. I can't believe it. The winning numbers uh, are 15, uh, I'm okay. 24, uh, and 18. It is true! Yay! <laughs> Wait a second. I shouldn't be wasting time. I better cash it in now. How to spend the money. Um, as like always, family first. I'll give my parents half of it. And I'll take the other half and live happily ever after. Gotta get myself a limo. Ooh, uh. But first I'm gonna quit this job. Uh, then I'll take over the company. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Who could be calling me now? Hello there, Vic speaking. Are you slacking uh, off or what, Logger Vic? Bosley? Who else calls you, you nincompoop? Bosley's never called this late before. Are you still there, Vector? Uh, I'm here, yeah. Listen, Rick, it's almost the middle of the year, so I'm coming over to check your progress. Huh? And you'd better be ready for me, because I'll be there tomorrow. Uh, Vic? Huh? Vic, are you listening to me? Uh, Bosley, that won't be necessary. I'll see you tomorrow. Wait, hey, boss? Why is he coming? I don't get it. Did he find out about the lottery ticket? Dang it. Huh, huh, huh. I really got to get this back to my place. <sighs> got to find somewhere to hide it. Ah! Nope. Much too predictable. I got to find somewhere safe. I'll have to think about it. Hmm. That's it! <laughs> uh, that's clearly not going to work. Whereabouts can I, uh? Yeah. Nah, too easy. This won't work. Obviously. Maybe the bathroom. <laughs> oh, nah, too gross. Oh, none of these places will work. Hmm. Uh, nowhere is safe. What to do? Uh, I know. I'll hide it in the forest. This place is totally creepy. The forest gets so much scarier in the middle of the night. Uh, I gotta finish this quickly. Oh, oh. Ah, that ought to do it. Oh, yeah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh. Hey! Uh. Oh. Stop that! Is someone trying to trick me? Who's there? Show yourself! Uh, oh, this place is haunted! Yeah. Huh. That logger Vic, I bet he was up to no good while I was visiting Herb! Well, I sure showed him! He won't be coming back! <laughs> Gotta find a place! Gotta find a place right now! Uh, ah, that'll do it! <laughs> there we go! This'll do nicely! <laughs> uh. 
Oh, what's going on? Oh, Don't you know it's quite impolite to throw trash in someone's home at midnight? That's annoying. Huh. Hey, Briar. Hey, wake up, bro. Briar, I need food. Bramble, you ate a huge dinner. You can't be hungry. But I am. Briar, will you find me some food, bro? Please. <laughs> will you? It's the middle of the night. I'm tired. I'm scared of the dark. I need you to go with me. Okay, okay, okay. I'll go, I'll go. You'll go? Wow. <laughs> oh, you're the best, bro. Try to hurry. <laughs> Where am I gonna hide this ticket? What's Lugger Vic doing up? Is he chopping down the trees while we're asleep? Gotta check this out. Ah, the bushes are no good either. What am I gonna do? I have to hide it tonight. Or the boss will take it for himself. This is just disastrously complicated. Yoink! Ooh! Logger uh, Vic? Uh, but Briar! You're logging at night now? Uh, no I'm not! I wouldn't do that! Briar, please may I have that note in your hand back? Huh? Oh, this note? Why does it make you so nervous? But, it doesn't! I'm not acting nervous! <laughs> what is this thing? Uh, hey, be careful with that ticket! I need it! It's a jackpot! I just won the super lottery, but I've got to hide it because my boss is coming. Say what? <laughs> With that ticket, I don't have to work anymore. However, if I can't take the ticket to the lottery, I'll just have to keep logging. So you're telling me, if you hide this piece of paper, you're done logging for good? That's right. Once I'm a rich man, I won't need to log anymore. All right. You can hide the ticket in my house. After your boss leaves, you'll come get it. If it's good for the forest, I'm in. <gasps> oh, thanks. Do you mean it? Sure thing. <laughs> ah, wonderful. <sighs> At least someone's sleeping. All right, let's hide this bad boy. <laughs> ah, but where to put it? Hey, this basket! Just remember where we put it. And when your boss is long gone, it'll be right here. Briar, uh, I owe you big time for this. Uh, okay, uh, no problem. It's getting late. I've got to get home. Thanks for everything. Bye-bye. <sighs> time for some shut-eye. Oh. Uh. Oh, poor Tommy. I almost forgot that Briar found some food for me. Ah. <laughs> Did he eat all of it? Oh. Huh? What's this thing? Oh. I guess I gotta go find my own food. Thank goodness the boss is gone. I'm gonna fetch my ticket and cash it. Yay! <laughs> Briar, 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 Briar! Hey! My boss is gone. I'm here to pick up the lottery ticket. You know, the one you hid for me. Uh huh? Oh, Vic, it's you. Yeah, it's over there in that basket. Get it yourself. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh -oh. Briar! Briar, wake up! The basket is empty! Briar! Where is it? Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to live news. Are those my Let's chairs. Watch the first <laughs> I'm such a loser. <laughs> Headmaster Jang of Pine Tree Mountain Primary School told the reporter that an anonymous person donated the winning lottery ticket to a disadvantaged uh. school. 
This That's my lottery time, ticket. Teachers and students uh, need it most. The school's resources are out of date, and with this donation, they will give the student body a richer environment to learn in. When asked to comment, Mr. Jang was speechless. Uh, a representative from the school uh, told us that every bit of the money would oh go well, towards I live in poverty, the student body. But I have a house, a job, and a truck. I guess I'm happy with my next. life. Hmm. They deserve it. Mommy Briar? Huh? <laughs> uh, there isn't any food anywhere. Oh, and if Bramble ever got his lazy bones out of bed. Huh? An egg? Oh yeah, lunchtime. Huh? Ah! <gasps> oh, uh. Mama! 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 You think I'm your mama? <laughs> mama! 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 Uh, no, 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 no. I'm not your mama. I'm just a very hungry bear. Huh? Hungry? Ooh, hungry, hungry! <laughs> that's right, that's right. Looking for food. Gotta get going. Uh, okay. Bye bye. <sighs> Huh? Stop following me! All right. See? That wasn't so hard. I am not your mama! Do you understand? <gasps> Stop saying that! I understand! Man, you look exhausted. Oh. Did you have a run-in with Vic or something? Uh, no, 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 no. It's just, uh, nothing. It's nothing. <sighs> Bramble, I'm tired. I need to rest. Uh, my gut tells me there's something wrong with Briar. How did he find me? Who's that? Sounds like someone's looking for mommy. Who's there? Huh? Huh. No one's here. I could have sworn I heard someone. Huh? Hello, excuse me. Can you please help me find my mama? Your mom? She's not here. Uh, Briar? Briar, are you really this duck's mom? Mama! 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 When will you get it through your cute face? I am not your mama. Look at you. You don't look anything like me. I'm a strong, dashing bear. See these muscles? Huh? See that? Look, I'm ripped. See? Now look at you. You will never be strong like me. Stop following me. Huh? My mama doesn't want me because I'm too weak. One day, I will be big and strong, just like mama. Look at all this fruit. Mama, I need breakfast. What? You found all this fruit? All by yourself? Hey, Briar. 
I think you are going to make a great mom. <laughs> Get out of my face. <laughs> Why doesn't my mama like me? What's wrong with that duck? Why does he think I'm his mom? <sighs> mama! <clears throat> Stay strong! Delicious. You know what, Briar? I think you'll make a great parent. And look at him, ain't he cute? And he'll help us around the house? We couldn't ask for a better kid. <laughs> ah, what do you think? Enough. Ah! I am a bear, not the mother of some confused little duck. But you'd be so good at it. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> You like him so much, huh? you be his mother. Huh? Hey, bro, wait up! Well, isn't this a lovely day off? I should really call my mom. Huh? A baby duck? Huh? Hmm. Ah. Hey, bro, wait for me! Huh? Uh, uh. Logger Vic? Oh no, Vic's after the duck! You don't think he's gonna turn our little buddy into roast what? duck? What? Ro ro roast duck? Listen to me, uh -huh. we gotta save that duck from Logger Vic. But the duck can't see us, he'll only think I'm his mom, hmm. got it? Mm. Come on, <laughs> think, Briar. Almost got him. Huh? Uh, <laughs> what are the bears doing here? <laughs> oh boy, the jig is up. Maybe they're hunting that poor duckling. <laughs> Not on my watch. Ah, <clears throat> uh, what? Who's there? Yeah. Oh, why thank you. Ah, uh, <laughs> baby ducky. Now's my chance. <laughs> so you want to race, do ya? Bring it on. <laughs> I'm too fast for you, aren't I? <laughs> Victory! Yeah! Stop! Oh, where'd the little duck go? Where is he? Not here. Bramble. Bramble. Wake up, Bramble. Bramble. My head feels funny. <laughs> <laughs> you just sneezed and chucked Vic into the lake. He almost had the duck. And then you came mm -hmm. and boom! Really? <laughs> so our little duck is safe then? Of course he's safe. Look! Huh? <laughs> I got you, little ducky. Huh? Let's be getting home now. Briar. Baby duck, I promise to save you from Lagervik's evil clutches! Yeah! We need a plan to get the duck from Vic's evil clutches. What do you have in mind? When we get to Lagervik's house, you need to draw his attention. Then I sneak in and save our ducky. Hmm. I'm worried about the little duck. Do you think Vic will force him to do his chores? Or maybe lock him up and starve him? Maybe Vic will turn him into duck soup. Ah, the poor little guy. <laughs> it's just your imagination. Let's go save our duck. Okay. Huh? Look 
at that. The duck was injured, and Vic wrapped up the wound. Say hello to your mommy. Oh, oh my baby. Oh. Come to Mama. Thank you so much. <laughs> what a wonderful thank you that was. <laughs> oh, oh, my pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> that whole time, Logger Vic just wanted to reunite a baby with his Who mother. I thought Logger Vic was such a softie. <laughs> Vic's barbecue. Oh, my stomach it hurts so much. <laughs> oh, it hurts so much. I must have eaten something that had gone off. Oh, I really need to be a bit more careful. Oh. Oh. If five potato kebabs cost four dollars, I can make ten dollars from just one potato. This is the best idea you've ever had, Victor. Oh, yeah. Victor's barbecue. It'll be the most delicious in town. <laughs> This'll be a piece of cake. I'm gonna rock it. Oh. Ha. oh, come on, yeah. Come down to Victor's Barbecue. Look at snow. It's amazing. Come to Victor's Barbecue. There's meat and fish and... <laughs> uh, I love barbecue. <laughs> uh, stay away. Leave me alone. Just go away. Liz, can I have one of the sausage ones? You came here to buy my food? <laughs> Does the sausage smell delish? Yeah. Oh, you want it, eh? Yeah. Don't you? <laughs> yeah. Aww. Huh, this is my new career, man. If you want one, you gotta pay. They're not for free. I'm off to town to make my fortune. <laughs> Who says I wasn't gonna pay you, Vic? You didn't even ask me. Aww. Good afternoon, everybody. Gather round and get some delicious barbecued meat and veg. Fresh, fresh, and cheap, cheap. Okay, everyone, come and try mine. Take a look at all this food. <laughs> it's delicious. Get it while it's hot before I run out. The best barbecue food you'll ever taste. Yeah, I'll take two. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> and it's done. There you are. Huh? Wait a second. Two vegetables. Oh, Where do you come from? He's stealing all my customers. Well, that's it. <laughs> just a sec, just a sec. One at a time. I'm like the barbecue king over here. I should quit logging. <laughs> Delicious skewers. Buy one, get one free. It's now or never, guys. Come quick. Oh, wait. Oh, no. The food's almost ready. Wait, hold it. <laughs> that man is a total pain. It's so unfair. <laughs> oh, my poor back. It's him! I know that guy! He's the skewer potato guy! The one that made me sick! And it still hurts me terribly, terribly. Hey! I wouldn't eat your food if you paid me! Huh. Uh, go away, you stupid little insects! Huh? Jeez! Look oh, at the size oh, of this guy! He's like a bear, wow. big boy! Wow. Totally <laughs> Here, take it. Have a little taste. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, huh? Ah, oh, a big fly! Huh? Yeah. A fly? Yeah. Not on my watch. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather have some of Vic's barbecue food. Uh, it was fun while it lasted. Huh? Longer Vic. Bramble. But <laughs> well, what you doing here? I want some kebabs. Uh, I'll trade you some apples for it since I got no money. Go away! You'll scare my customers! I just want to taste your kebabs! Come off, would you bramble? Mm -hmm. oh, 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 help us with my customers! Bramble, you got what you came here for. You can go now. A little huh? food over here! Ah, How do you it? Right down. this way! <laughs> <laughs> the best deal ever! Oh, oh. 100, 101, 102! 
All right. <laughs> I'll be rolling in it soon enough. <laughs> Ooh, there's a few left. I thought I sold all of them. What do I do with them? Hmm. Hmm? Eureka! <laughs> Just a bit of recycling. Nothing to see here. No one will notice. <laughs> go away. Go away, fly. Uh, oh, no. Oh, my vegetables ruined. Never mind. A bit of dirt never hurt anyone. No street vendors <laughs> allowed here, buddy. Oh, no. I'm sorry, sir. It won't happen again. No business license and no health permit. You're running an illegal ah, business. Out of here. I'm finding you. Come on, come on. Quick, 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 quick. Big one. Say, please, sir, let me explain. Uh huh. Hey, look. See him? Hey. He's also doing illegal work. Do you think I'm blind? He's a delivery guy. Stop trying to change the subject. <laughs> hey, I'm waiting. <laughs> <laughs> uh, huh? uh, my stomach really uh, hurts, bro. Uh, what uh, happened? Uh, I just ate some of Longer Vic's barbecue food. What? <laughs> Why would you eat anything man-made? You know, I bet he put poison in that food he gave you, bro. I'll go sort him out. <laughs> Wait up, bro. Uh, uh, we still need to stop him from selling more of that stuff. I'll never get caught. Look <laughs> at quick form. <laughs> huh? Uh, Delivery? Uh, <laughs> Hang on. That guy looks so familiar. Hi! <laughs> it's him again. In such hot weather, his food had better be refrigerated. I'm on to you. Ah! Stop right there. <laughs> hey, you. Get back here. I got a couple words for huh? you. He was here a moment ago. Huh? Where did he go? Well, he must have gone somewhere else. Huh? Let's go find him. Okay. <sighs> it certainly is getting harder earning money these days. They smell so bad. It must be because of the hot weather. Yo, anybody here? Uh, Ten kebabs, please. I ain't got all day. Huh? I'll be right with you. It'll just oh, be a couple of minutes, you okay? Look at that. <laughs> I'm sure he won't even notice. <laughs> I'll just add a few extra herbs and spices, and no one will know that the food's gone bad. Here's your kebabs. Enjoy! Oh! Whoa! Hey, that smells great! Hey, there you go! <laughs> Come again! <laughs> you wanna show me your business license? <gasps> huh? You, you again? again. <sighs> uh, we're getting closer! Smells so good! <laughs> I guess your stomach pain is gone then! <laughs> Hey, weren't you that delivery guy? Enlighten me. How did you all of a sudden become a barbecue vendor? <laughs> I had some spare food. It was an unclaimed delivery. So, waste not, what not. <laughs> hmm. Whatever the reason is to sell this food, you must have a business license and a health permit. Well, I left those at home. Uh, it's the oldest trick in the book. No business license and no health permit. That's $500. Ah! Oh, please wait. Take a look. My food is very clean. I promise. There's no problem with my food. Hmm. I'm not a fool. Is that what you think? <gasps> Rotten cabbage with wormholes in it? Disgusting. Old slices of potato? A disgrace. To top it all off, moldy fish. I should arrest you. This is absolutely outrageous. Huh? You really need to chill out, bro. This is totally delicious. And we all know chefs never lie. <laughs> oh, no, not again. 
You poisoned oh yourself. God. You okay? <laughs> Hang in there. I'll get someone to help. Just wait a minute. Told you so, bro. Huh? Let's just stick to honey from now on. Hmm. Hey, bro. Maybe we should take Lager Vic to the hospital. Oh. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> He's over here. Huh? That's weird. Where'd he go? Logger Vic, I don't think you should barbecue anytime soon. Don't you worry. I won't. Oh, my tummy's hurting. <laughs>